Hi there, it's Medusa, and this is my review for the movie Those That Wish Me Dead on Amazon Prime, starring Angelina Jolie. So first of all, my first kind of initial thing I want to say is that I really enjoyed this movie. It's by no means a cinematic masterpiece, but I found it really fun and um, enjoyable to watch. Um, I also think it is the most 12-15 I've ever seen. Like, I cannot think of one instance that really ne why it needed to be a 15 it just it does feel quite there's not much blood there's not much swearing i really think it should there's quite a lot of threat but still i mean there's been 12s that are far worse in terms of like violence and swearing and stuff so really i think it should have been a 12. So keeping it spoiler free, um, Angelina Jolie plays as Hannah, this a smoke jumper who has got a traumatic experience where a mistake made on the team during a forest fire led to the death of three young boys and she blames herself. And so she's kind of, due to a failed psych eval, she's sent to kind of just watch over from a tower to see if there's any forest fires. And of course she somehow comes into contact with a young, a young boy who is trying to run away from people that want him dead. My favourite part of the movie was the relationship between Hannah and the little boy Connor because um, it's very, very sweet and heartwarming. Despite the drama, obviously, there are some, you know, comedic moments between them. And there's also just this sense of, you know why this little boy would trust her, even despite all he's just seen. Something that I thought was actually really refreshing was the fact that um, Hannah's ex-boyfriend is the Punisher. <laughs> And but they have a good relationship. It isn't. He's not trying to win her back. Not win him back. You know they're kind of a good kind of healthy, respectful, you know, friendshipish kind of relationship with each other. And he's married with a baby on the way, and his wife plays a big role in the story overall. But also, she's also not as well really jealous and like, oh, you hanging out with Angelina Jolie again? It's like very grown up. Everything is. It's pretty good. Something that I really appreciated about this movie was the fighting and when people were fighting each other the, the violence and the action felt very or at least a lot more realistic than a lot of action movies. Saying that there was a really good one scene where the Punisher went pretty unhinged Punisher which was great. <laughs> Those That Wish Me Dead has a very disaster movie feel to it at times which is really good. It has something kind of like Skyscraper or San Andreas um, and I honestly think this would be a good like Saturday night movie with the family um, even though there's a little bit of threat because it has got that kind of feel to it. I hadn't even seen the trailer for this movie when I watched it. To be honest I just saw Angelina Jolie and thought you know what I'm sure it's going to be great <laughs> and I wasn't disappointed. This is a really fun movie. My only sort of criticism I guess is that there is like a kind of plot Whole, maybe not plot hole but there are some unexplained things that don't really feel resolved by the end like where exactly the people that are after the wee boy are from and even though I know this book this uh, movie is based on a book I still hope that they'll make a sequel to this movie this movie has a fun, thrilling, like intense plot and a star-studded cast and it's honestly definitely worth a watch Thank you very, very much for watching my very short review. Please leave a comment about your opinions about the movie. And yeah, thank you very much for watching.